Hi everybody, it's Siobhan. So I haven't seen you guys in a while. Um, the last video I did I think was um, just my trip to ShopRite. So come on over, say hi. Hi! How are you? How are you doing? So I thought I would just do a little bit of a chat here with you and see how everybody's doing. Um, I know my hair is probably crazy. I am so excited. I can't go, the sun is too bright. But, um, so at the end of this month, on the 29th, I'm going to get my hair done. <laughs> it's this new salon called Moisture, Moisture Curls, I think is the name of it. And the people that, well the owner, he specializes in just curly hair. And as you guys can see, like, it's a hot mess. I haven't had my hair cut in well over a year, I think. I think it's been almost a year. And it's just, I don't even know what to do with it anymore. It's just there. And it's poofy and it need, it's really thick. It needs to get thinned out and everything. So um, I'm excited to see because it, when you see the pictures, like the before and after, the people's hair is so frizzy. You don't even, you couldn't even tell that they had curls. And then um, after he puts a few things in your hair, it's like, wow. So I'm excited for that. That's the end of this month. And um, right in time for our vacation. So I am going to do a couple of videos preparing um, to go away. So I want to do a video kind of all about cruising and whatnot. Um, I'm not sure if anybody is too interested in that or not. But um, we've gone on several cruises now. I can't even... I don't even remember how many we've been on. I want to say eight, probably seven or eight of them, I think. I don't, I can't think of it off the top of my head. Um, but anyways, so we're going to try to, I want, we're doing Royal Caribbean. I think I told you guys in a, a previous video before, but um, this is one that we have been dying to go on. We, um, my mom and I went several several years ago and our very first cruise was on Royal Caribbean and when we went we did a five night to Bermuda because we would never been on a cruise before and didn't know what to expect or if we would even like it or not so um, when we went on it we fell in love and then from that point on we always said we wouldn't do a five night again because it doesn't give you enough time like you just get there and like you're you're back home so we've done seven night cruises we've done Bermuda numerous times we've done uh, Florida and Bahamas so this one is nine nights ten days and we're going out of New Jersey what <gasps> oh no! Cook big bad wolf! <gasps> There's a big bad wolf in our backyard! Oh no! That's his new story. Little Red Riding Hood now. And uh, the three little pigs. So anyways, we... Um, this one is going out of um, Bayonne, New Jersey. And it's going to Bermuda first. And you're there for the whole day. And then we go to St. Martin, then we go to San Juan, Puerto Rico, and then we go to Haiti, which is their private island, Labadee. So I'm really excited about that because, like I said, it's been a cruise that we've wanted to do for so long. It's expensive. Um, it's more than we've paid for a cruise, but it's definitely, in my mind, worth it because of how long you're gone. Um, and the ship that we're going on is Anthem of the Seas. So I've been on YouTube watching videos after video after video just to see. Um, and we always get midship um, inside balcony, an inside stateroom. Um, one, day, one time we're going to do a cruise and go in a balcony one day. And um, hopefully the next one will go on. Um, there is a tip if you guys ever try, like if you're interested, you can always ask the day you get there to check in if there is any rooms available for you to upgrade. 
Um, I know a couple of people that have gotten upgrades like from a state room, an inside interior room um, up to a balcony room with no charge. So, um, and they do that because this, the rooms aren't sold and they're losing the money anyway, so they might as well make you happy, right? So, I'm crossing my fingers <laughs> that they have some balconies, which I highly doubt they probably won't, but um, you never know. But on Royal, they have these new things called a virtual balcony. Oh, there's his basketballs. Go shoot a hoop and we'll, sh we'll, sh we'll see. There's his basketball hoop. He has to show you guys. He's very busy. But um, anyways, as I was saying, is they have uh, virtual balconies. So it's a window and um, you use a remote to turn it on and it shows you everything outside. So it looks like you have a balcony, which I think is gonna be really nice because um, interior rooms, the only thing I don't like about it is you don't know what time of day because there's no window. So it's always dark, you know, not dark, but you don't see the sunlight come out, you know. So I'm looking forward to that. But I want to do a video just on like preparing like what we do before we go on a cruise. Bobby, Bobby. Okay. Here's your hoop. You're going to make a basket. Dunk. Yeah. Woohoo! Good job. Woohoo! High five. Awesome. So um, I want to do a video on what we pack. Um, I'll probably do a video while I'm packing. And this time we're actually well, we packed a suitcase for him the last time we went, um, just because there was a lot of things that he needed, and. Um, so, probably have to do that again. But I'm I am making a list of stuff that I want, and my mom actually made a list, and she printed it off and laminated it so she could use a dry erase marker. So she has the list all the time, and all she has to do is cross it off and erase it, and she'll have it for the next time. So um, I'll definitely share all that stuff with you, and anything else I can think of. And I also want to do some videos for you while we're on the ship so that you guys can see. Um, obviously, they're not going to be uploaded, though, until after the trip because I'm not paying for the Wi-Fi, the internet package. So, But I can make videos, several videos throughout the trip. And then I'll just upload them afterwards. But Tell everybody where we're going. Oh, uh, uh, we're gonna go on a big, big cruise ship. Big cruise ship. See Statue of Liberty. He's gonna see the Statue of Liberty. Ooh, ooh. See, ow. See, SpongeBob. SpongeBob. I don't know if SpongeBob's on this one. Uh huh. We'll have to see. Cruise ship. Don't mess this hair up more than it already is. Oh well. What are we gonna do about it? So, what else should we talk about? Who's coming this weekend? Maybe. Who's coming this weekend to see you? Say it louder, they can't hear you. It's Easter Bunny! The Easter Bunny. Oh, so, that is it. I don't want to take up too much of your time, but I thought I would just get on here and do a quick little video, do a little chit chat, um, and give you something to look forward to. And I actually have a bunch of free things that I got in the mail that I kind of wanted to do a video on just so you guys can see. Um, there's different places you can sign up. There's like a uh, freebie, I think it's freebie hoot, H-O-O-T, um, that sends emails, I think almost every day or every couple of days with different freebies and you can go on to the websites and fill out the information and get your freebies so um, I do that a lot too but I think that'll be the next video that I do and I'll post it so you guys can see some of the stuff that I've gotten and then I think we'll start doing the cruise getting ready for it because 
Today is the 12th, so we are now under a, a month until we leave. So we're at 29 days, and um, that's it. We actually, there is one exciting thing. So on the ship, they do DreamWorks characters. So it's like, I think the Kung Fu Panda and the Madagascar Lion and like all those guys. Puss, Puss in Boots. Puss in Boots is on the ship, I think. And um, anyways, they have a character breakfast. So you can go in. It's into the dining room, one of the dining rooms. And <clears throat> you have breakfast at this t nice table. And all the different characters come out. And you get to um, do meet and greets with them. And get pictures done and all that good stuff. And it's... Um, what do you call it? It's... He, Jaden would be free because he's under five and adults are $10. So it's a $10 surcharge. But honestly, you think about it. If you're out at home, you can't go out for breakfast for $10 for an adult or for two adults. So $20 for two adults. Um, it's going to be me, my husband, and my mom. So it'll be $30 for the three of us plus Jaden. And, you know, I think it'll be fun. I th wasn't going to do it because I thought it would cost a lot more. But for $10, I don't think that that's a bad price at all. Plus, we don't have to pay for pictures. We can take our own. And I might take videos of it, too. So, But that is it for now. I will talk to you guys all later. I hope you guys all have a great day. Can you say bye? Bye.